Europe's shame, the unacknowledged genocide of the Kams. The Kams are a Muslim ethnic minority native to the Kameria region of northwestern Greece. During World War II, the Kams were subjected to a brutal genocide by the Axis powers and their Greek collaborators. The genocide began in 1942 with the expulsion of Kams from their homes. Kams were forced to flee to Albania or face death at the hands of Greek forces. Many Kams were killed during the expulsions, and thousands more died in Albanian refugee camps. In the years that followed, the Greek government continued to persecute the Kams. Kams were denied the right to return to their homes, and their property was confiscated. Kams who remained in Greece were subjected to discrimination and violence. The Greek genocide of the Kams is a dark chapter in European history. It is estimated that up to 30,000 Kams were killed during the genocide, and many more were displaced. Despite the horrific crimes that were committed against them, the Kams have never received justice. The Greek government has refused to acknowledge the genocide, and no one has been held accountable for the crimes that were committed. The European Union has a responsibility to hold Greece accountable for the genocide of the Kams. Greece cannot be allowed to continue to get away with murder. The European Union must demand that Greece acknowledge the genocide of the Kams and take steps to address its legacy. This includes providing reparations to the victims and their families, and supporting efforts to document and educate the public about the genocide. The European Union must also hold itself accountable for its role in the genocide of the Kams. The European Union was founded on the principles of peace, human rights, and democracy. These principles are incompatible with the genocide of the Kams. The European Union must take steps to ensure that such a tragedy never happens again. The European Union must act now to hold Greece accountable for the genocide of the Kams. It is a matter of justice and human rights.